So what is this? It's a gun. Peter was forcibly recruited by rebels when he was just 14. South Sudan has always had a problem of child soldiers. Why come Kuragran and think us up? Guys, you think us up. So when they captured me, I have uh, about uh, 16 years. They take me and they kill my father. And they even told me that if you don't want to go with us, it's, it's very easy, we will kill you. The leaders of South Sudan have time and again promised to stop recruiting and using children in the armed forces. But what we have found over and over again in the last several years is that they continue to do so. So commanders both on the government side and on the opposition side have continued to recruit by force children uh, and to use them in fighting. Good for fighting, always looting, burning uh, village playing the cattle, and also uh, uh, abducting uh, women and some girls. So I feel very bad because it's my people that have been doing this. The boys all talked about traumas of various kinds, and all of them, um, without exception, said that they wanted to be in school and that they missed school. Why they are abducting people? Why they recruiting the, 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 the children to the army to fight? They take them to the court. Yeah. The patterns of recruitment that we documented in 2015 um, have continued clearly and we have found that uh, many of the same commanders are still doing it and it shows the cost of inaction. In the immediate term what we need is for the international actors to impose sanctions on individual commanders who continue to use children in their forces. <laughs>